Probably we'll start with you. Was there a lot of pressure on you after losing that first game today to Oregon Tech to come out and deliver? Um, yeah, there's a lot of pressure, but um, to be honest, that's what I love so much about softball is I love having that pressure on my back. I do better under pressure, so I mean, um, of course, you know, we love easy games, but I'd rather be under pressure, so that's right where I wanted to be. Yeah. Courtney, what was the mindset as a team going in, in, in between games going into that second game today? And we just need to focus on ourselves. Sometimes we get out of that groove where we tend to like veer towards them more than ourselves, and that's where when we have fun, we dance, and we're all joking around. That's that's us. That's how we win. That's how we stick together as a family. It's when we have a chance back, and that's what we went back to that second game. In the first game today, Kelly Scott, the pitcher for Oregon Tech, was forcing a lot of fly balls. They were actually hit pretty well just right at people. How do you adjust to that as a hitter? Um, personally, I tell myself I'm a good hitter. I can do this. I I just try to tell myself, like, you know what, beat this girl. You're a good hitter. Find something that she's giving you that you can hit. And we were just a little early on her, so we were making more uh, progress the second game when we were holding back. Carly, let's talk about this team as a whole, 43-5, uh, a historic, incredible year. Talk a little bit about this team as a group together. Um, this team is probably the best team I've ever played on. Um, we are a family, and <laughs> nothing can come between us, ever. Um, we have each other's back 100%, and I think that's the most important part. Um, we lose that first game, but we all talked and we're like, you know what, let's do what we always do, have fun, have each other's back, so it makes a mistake, you pick them up. And that's why we're so successful, is because no matter what happens, that next person picks you up. And I believe that's, you know, what we have, what we do best is we pick each other up, we have each other's back, and we're a family. Um, there's no clicks, there's no, you know, cattiness, there's there's nothing. I mean, it doesn't matter who is on that field, we know that they're going to do their job and do it the best, and if they feel like they can't do it, they have no problem stepping out and letting the next person in. There's no person that wants to be there more than we do. So, um, I think that's, that pretty much sums it up if you ask for one word to describe our team as a family. Courtney, how does this compare to getting the bid to go into the National Christian College Association Championship last year, the National Championship last year? Um, well, I mean, it's pretty much the same thing. We just want to win. That's all our mindset's on. Um, yes, it's a different tournament. Um, there's still going to be great teams. There's great teams in um, NCCAA, so we just got to go out, I mean, go as hard as we can and do what we do best. And how excited are you guys looking forward into the NAI World Series? Um, there's no words to describe it. I mean, as soon as we got that third out, nobody could even, you know, say a word. We all just started crying. Um, you know, we got tears out of coach even, and that usually never happens. So we we are grateful. Um, we've worked so hard for this. We feel like we deserve it more than anybody. And there's nothing these seniors want to leave Simpson with than a ring on their hand. And last question for you, Courtney. Uh, what is head coach Wayne Stowe meant for you guys as a team? Um, he's kind of like the glue. Like he glues us together. He um, has been working on being positive around us because we feed off each other so much. Um, he's been pretty much the glue to this family. He keeps us together. He keeps us positive. He keeps us up. He, you know, when someone's down on themselves, he, he reminds us to be positive and know what kind of player we are because he knows that he brought us here for a reason and we're like he, we're playing these games because we're good and he knows that. We're a team and he is part of that team too. Yeah. He's the glue to our family. Thanks guys. Thank you. Awesome.